it's Veronica with the coffee drinking shop and mama. Um, I look crazy. My hair looks crazy. I'm crazy because we have not had AC at our house in two days in Texas in August in 106, 7, 8 degrees weather. So what happened was it was a Saturday and we were gone literally all day from like 10 a.m. and we got home after 7. We had took it, taken our kids somewhere um, and like for the day and we got home and the thermostat was reading like 80 something degrees and I was like did you I turned to my husband and I said did you turn the air off while we were gone why would you do that um and he said no so of course you know we went all around and <sighs> it's just not working so I immediately called you know our AC repair people and they were like I'm so sorry you know we can't come until Monday so I called around to a couple other people and they all said the same thing so today is Monday in my real life world and we have not had AC Saturday night, all day Sunday, and so far today. They're supposed to give me like a 30 minute window. My husband works from home, he's home. He likes hot and like, he's like, I'm fine, this is fine. I'm like, I'm not fine. Like, we are not fine, this is not okay. Um, so of course, you know, we had fans going, we had all the things, it, it was, we survived up until this point and I told the kids I was like be glad y'all going to school on Monday <laughs> in the AC um so we did I did take them out Sunday to do some things too so we weren't just like sitting at home all day Sunday in the heat um we kept all our windows closed fans on all that stuff and I told my son I was like this is how people felt in like 18 57 or something so I'm at Walmart I told my husband you might be fine but I'm not I'm just going somewhere I have something to return to TJ Maxx so I did that now I'm over here at Walmart I don't have a lot of things to pick up but I'm gonna waste a little bit of time in here I did tell my husband that I would pick him up something for for lunch I have not cooked that's the only upside to it if you will I like cook some things in the air fryer uh, and stuff like that but I haven't legit cooked like for you know since Saturday uh, well we were going all day Saturday so all day Sunday I told my husband I would bring him something for lunch it's now like 10 30 and he, um like 10 and he eats lunch at 11 because the people he works with their their time is like an hour ahead so it would be a, it would be noon for them so I just told him I would bring him something home at 11 which kind of puts me in a time crunch really thinking about it now I probably should have just like stayed home and made him something in the air fryer and then left so that I wouldn't have to come back again at 11. But whatever. I have a couple of things. We need some milk and this and that at Walmart. So I'm just going to run in and get that and then maybe go pick him up. I'm like, what serves lunch at 1030? Probably just pick him up Chick-fil-A Chick or something like that. Because um, I know they start serving lunch at 1030. But anyway, I thought maybe you would want to come with me in Walmart and let's just look around for a few minutes. I have to get some milk, some cookies. There's this um, cookie recipe I want to use but it's like a no-bake cookie so you take these Maria cookies or something and you like grind them up and make like the base and then you cover it with chocolate I don't know but I need those some turkey sticks and we're just gonna look around and see I really want the Drew Barrymore collection my birthday is September 17th so that's right around the corner I told my mom if she wants to give me a gift card to Walmart or go in on <laughs> buy me one of these that would be some croissants um for like breakfast and stuff they are $4.98. Oh no, I dropped one, but this one is good until 9 4. So we're gonna get that one instead of the one's good until 8 30. Which one are these? So it's pre made, like little pumpkins, and you can decorate them yourself. Um, how much are they? I don't see a price on them. Oh, $9.87. And then you can do these, and they can color them sugar cookie coloring kit, six cookies, three marbles. Those are three marbles. Did I say three marbles? Markers. So those are cute too for the kids. Get two of these English cucumbers. We really love cucumbers and these are 98 cents each. So got some bananas and I'm going to get me some of these Carb Smart. I haven't seen them in a long time. They're my favorite fudge bars. 50 calories and they are so good. Um, I came down this aisle to get my kids oh, some of these Alpshine bars. Um, we're gonna get this one right here. They really like these, and they're six bucks. I'm gonna grab one of these waffles. They're pretty inexpensive. I think they're like a dollar fifty or something, but I don't see the price on that one. Look, 
great value brand has Ninja Turtles on their macaroni and cheese. I haven't seen that before. I'm going to grab one of those. I'm sure Ryan, my son, would like that. My husband's birthday is coming up. I'm actually going to make his cake. So I'm getting this yellow cake mix. It's a dollar. I'm going to make it look like the Moroccan flag if I can. So we need some green frosting and red frosting. Um, but the red, I need it like in a tube. So I don't see, oh, maybe, maybe this. That's $5 for that. Hmm. Day. Decorating icing. I'm pretty sure this is what I need. This one or this one right here. I think I'm gonna get this one. It's just two bucks. I just need to basically draw a star with this one. So yeah, that'll work. Hey okay, y'all, these are the cookies I need for my recipe, and they're just 92 cents for a pack. So I got three of those. These are good to grow snackers, but look how cute. Um, the price is not cute at six bucks each. Um, because what can you reuse this? Like, I guess, as like a little snack container. Is it open? Let me see. I can't do this with one hand. Hold on. I do open. It was hard to open, but this will be open, so I don't know how you would reuse it. I guess you can reuse the the bot that's the whole bottom, but yeah, those are cute. This is interesting. Honey and jalapeno chicken snack sticks. I'm gonna get those for me, but I don't see the price. Six dollars maybe. Um, but I'm looking for the ones I always get my kids. This is unfortunate. I don't see the great value brand ones I get my kids all the time. Um, it's like they're usually there and they're gone. Oh, so that stinks. They eat those a lot for snacks. So I may have to go to Aldi one day and pick those up. I'm just, I don't get out much or <laughs> if these are new, I have never seen Doritos or Sun Chips or any of that. And like Cheetos in these containers, like Pringles, they're $2.74 got their Halloween cereals $4.93 Count Dracula Frankenberry or Munster Mash Remix I don't know what the Munster Mash Remix is Count Drac Count Chocula used to be my favorite also out of my water enhancer that I love looks like they're out of a lot of things I was needing today up a bag of the cube cheddar cheese for the kids $2.37 these Lunchables are $1.63. I'm just going to get one each um, for the kids for like a fun lunch. All right, while I'm here and I see it, I'm going to go ahead and get one of the zero sugar pumpkin spice. And caramel almond creamer. I'm actually, you know what, I might go to Sam's Club and get like the huge one of those. So I'm just going to get this small one right now. The 10 slices of bacon. Fair life milk. I got some of the cell stuff, so I'm going to pick these up for the kids. But I know, I don't get out much. Snoop Dogg got his own wine, some rosé. They really do have some cute kids clothes. Some really cute things. Especially if you like Disney. Some Harry Potter. We've been reading Harry Potter with the kids. We're on book one because then I got sick for like a week <laughs> and I couldn't read to them. Um, so, but I'm looking for a shirt. I'm heading through here um, because I want just a plain black shirt and they have some in the junior section for like three dollars. So I'm going to grab one of those. Some Minecraft slippers for 15. Some taco slippers. <laughs> those are funny. Ninja Turtles. Those are cute. Mario. The boys. I like those brown ones right there. Boy shoes. They're just $3.78 and they have all sorts of colors and these work really well for just a really great basic. The Halloween stuff. We have a little bit of the candy. Got your buckets. Um, looks like mine just pretty much has the candy out. I don't really see much else. All the candy corn. 
got their Scooby snacks. Oh, cute. Their Halloween Go Go Squeezes. I love to get all the Halloween y um, snacks for the kids. <laughs> all right. Oh, Harry Potter. Now I'm drawn to everything Harry Potter. But yeah, just the candy right now. Some books for these to go on sale i don't know if they will like drop down like to get some for next year or this year they can use it this year i don't care i just want them to go on clearance <laughs> some of the drew barrymore collection i was trying to tell you guys about i want all of it this is her big skillet and she's got a slow cooker hopefully they have the slow cooker out so I can show you guys, yeah, I see her here on the end. I just love this white and gold. The slow cooker is 59. And I just, I don't know, I am to that age where this, these are the things that interest me. Fancy new slow cookers and she's got a popcorn maker. Um, and what else does she have? I can't remember, a toaster, but I don't see her toaster out here. Um, but yeah, she's got all the things and I want all of them in the white and the gold. Her blender. I don't really need the blender. I like my Ninja blender and it doesn't sit out all the time, but that's cute too. Barely made it out of Walmart on time. We're like strapped. We have to hurry, girl. Um, we spent about $60 in Target, which I, at Walmart, uh, which honestly I thought it was gonna be more. I'm in line now to pick up my husband's order. Um, he always is a spicy deluxe sandwich. And I got just an eight count grilled chicken nuggets. That was it. I didn't order any French fries, but I mean, who's with me? You gotta steal a French fry. I mean, I, uh, yeah. I, there's no shame in it. I feel absolutely, I'm not ashamed of stealing one French fry. I went and got this for you. This is like the, the tax on me going to get you lunch. So, there. We're at the stoplight. I did also try these turkey snack sticks. I don't know, that light didn't stay long. Um, anyway, these ones I just got at Walmart. So darn good. I'm telling you guys, 60 calories, 2 grams of fat, 6 grams of protein on these. Um, Mighty Spark is who makes them. Get you some. There's four in there and they're pretty big just, you know, for 60 calories. That's why I only got the grilled chicken nuggets for myself at Chick-fil-A because I ate one of those and I'm just not feeling too hungry. But I figured some more protein. I can have it later. And I saw this on TikTok. This girl said to get grilled chicken nuggets, a side of pickles, and then the honey roasted uh, mustard, like in the packet, not the dipping sauce, the one that's in the packet. And she mixed that all together, like put that all in the bowl and like shook it up together. And she says it's amazing and like, you know, hardly any fat or carbs or whatever well you're like carbs from your pickles but anyway she's like that's my go-to lunch like during like she was trying to lose weight and stuff um so i'm gonna try that see how it works out it's really so hot in here i can't turn any lights on <laughs> like none um but as for a side of pickles me too <laughs> so this apparently is what you're supposed to do you're supposed to mix your chicken with the honey roasted barbecue and the pickles and that's like your meal so i'm gonna try it all right let's do this i have read so so many books since we have last talked that i probably can't even do it in this video because i know i just talked for chick-fil-a can't with you today two pickles i could i could have dealt with the two pickles Clearly, clearly said grilled nuggets. What else can go wrong? I'm burning up in here. I'm sweating in my home. <laughs> grilled nuggets. Okay, well, I'll have to, I'm gonna eat on those. I'm not cooking anything in this hot house. It's not happening. And that is disappointing because I was really, really been trying to watch what I eat better because it has not been good lately and go with the honey mustard barbecue whatever <sighs> okay I guess I'll just do <laughs> this and dip it in that and then eat it with pickle see how it is
I mean, it's a Chick-fil-A nugget. Obviously, it's good. Man, I should have cleaned my face up a little bit more. Anyway, we'll have to talk about books, y'all, because I've read so many good books. So many. Apparently, I love, I don't even know if I'm saying her name right, Alice Feeney. Remember that book I told you about, Rock, Paper, Scissors? That was so good. I just read another one of her books. Um... I think it's called I Know Who You Are or something. I'll post it here somewhere, you know, like I always do. Also good. Also a twist. A real crazy, like disgusting twist, if I'm being honest. But that one was good. Um, and I have another one of her books on my list for you next. Um, that's why I'm reading Colleen Hoover, It Ends With Us. That's what I'm about to start now. I've, the only book I've read by Colleen Hoover so far is Verity. Loved it. Um, but several people recommended It Ends With Us, so I'm reading that next. Then another one of Alice Feeney, F I think it's F-E-E, -E. well, you'll see when I post it here. Another one of her books, so. I think this video is pretty long right now, so I'm going to go ahead and end this one here, y'all. I'm just going to sit here and wait for the AC repairman. I'm going to eat this lunch, and it is so hot in here. I need to wash my car, so I might actually just run up to like the car wash, wash my car, vacuum it out, just to like waste some more time like outside of the house, and then hopefully, I'm really hoping, it's 11.30 now, I'm really hoping he'll be here soon, like maybe like while I'm eating, because they said they would call and give us like a 30 minutes head, head up, heads up, so I'm like, please call now, please call now, like I need to clean, I need to do laundry, I need to do a lot of stuff, but it's too hot in here like really um so yeah but I have tomorrow that's one thing I keep telling myself when I'm like oh you gotta do this you gotta do that you gotta do this there's tomorrow girl there's tomorrow I mean don't stress yourself but I do I stress myself I'm like I really need to get this done today like why you're not doing anything tomorrow you don't have anything like pressing tomorrow I do have a lot of PTA stuff this week um like we have a PTA like general membership meeting Wednesday um, and then Thursday we have a spirit night in the evening and then Friday morning we have our board member meeting and then Nyla has gymnastics Monday night and she has soccer Tuesday night Wednesday night I have spirit night um, Thursday is my husband's birthday so I'm gonna make him a cake and like um, try to do something nice for him during the day. I was thinking, like, maybe we could go out for a nice lunch together since the kids, you know, aren't home. Like, if he has time, like, in his schedule, maybe we can go, I don't know, play pool or do something, just the two of us, for, like, an hour or two during the day. Um, and then Friday we have a board member meeting. And then Saturday I want to take the kids to a planetarium that I found. And time flies like I've said I don't know if I said to this on here I think I did but like I swear the time between 8 a.m. and 3 p.m. literally feels like five minutes so the time is flying it really is so anyway okay wish me luck with the AC repair because this is getting insane and I will see you later bye